welcome to another side of Tom DeLonge on Pepsi Smash. I have a shoe company named Macbeth Footwear. And this is where we do the Macbeth project. This is where I sit with rulers and computers and I do everything. I have a really cool part in the company because I actually don't have to do any work. I just have to go in there and come up with ideas and really smart, talented people add to them and take those ideas and actually make them happen. Like, you know, vintage running shoes and soccer shoes and all these different types of cool things. This was one of the first things we did. This is a vegan shoe. We do vegan stuff. So Natalie Portman, come wear our stuff. My goal, I guess, would be for Macbeth to be like a new Adidas, you know, where we pride ourselves on indoor soccer shoes and old school runners and, and vintage styles, classics. The coolest thing about this company is that we're trying to do something completely different. Just because of who we are, we're always going to be lending ourselves towards controversial topics, but it's more of a deeper thing. It has to do with the, more of an ex the extremes of human emotion. We just hired this guy, but he's not really doing anything. I know it sounds weird. How is this all coming from a shoe company? Well, it's because we didn't want to create just another shoe company. We wanted to do something that helped a movement in rock and roll. The company, Macbeth, it's, it's a group of extremely talented friends having fun doing what they love with with extreme passion it's like this one epicenter of, of creative thought and the the heart and soul of what angels and airwaves is doing is right in the middle of the building and it reverberates I guess I think through every inch of that building so everybody wants to know how we created the angels and airwaves world and how to get there and how come they can't go themselves. Well, I'll tell you why you can't go, because in this building is a special portal that goes to another world, a new world, and let me show you where that's at. When I was in Blink and that part of my life was kind of coming to an end, I need to restart my life and my career in music. Welcome to Angels and Airwaves. Building Angels and Airwaves was like a complete healing process, and it truly ended up becoming the most powerful an exceptional thing I've ever done in my life and my career. This is where Angels and Airwaves rehearses. This is where we write all of our music. This is a new world. This very much fits the idea of what we're doing. We're trying to change the world by first changing ours. So, we had to create it. I was a normal human being that got thrown into an extraordinary situation, but I had the faith that something beautiful and angelic could happen in my life, and it did. Thank you for checking out another side of Tom DeLong on Pepsi Smash. You are welcome.